हेलो गाइज वेलकम टू संजीव कपूर खजाना माई नेम सिद्धार्थ एंड टुडे आई शो यू अ वेरी पॉपुलर रेसिपी फ्रॉम चाइना द नेम ऑफ दिस रेसिपी इज हाइनिस चिकन राइस बट दिस रेसिपी इज पॉपुलर इन सिंगापुर थाईलैंड मलेशिया एक्सेट्रा सो लेट्स लुक एट द इंग्रीडियंट्स वॉट ऑल विल रिक्वायर टू मेक दिस ब्यूटिफुल फ्लेवरफुल रेसिपी होल चिकन कट इन टू फोर पीसेस विथ स्किन rice soaked for half an hour and drained chicken stock bean sprouts sesame oil salt chopped garlic spring onion greens chopped chopped ginger light soy sauce so let's start with the recipe first i'll put some salt and pepper to the chicken and rub this properly there are many ways you can prepare hainanese chicken This is one of the way. If you want, you can directly boil the chicken, or else you get the seared one, the braised one. For me, the braised chicken tastes amazing, so I'm making this. So for this, it's very important to have chicken with skin, and the chicken should be nice and fresh. So after marinating this with salt and pepper, it's ready to sear. So for that, first I'll heat up a pan and add sesame oil to this. Now here the pan is hot enough. What I'll do is and sear the chicken skin side down. You just need to sear the chicken, not cook it completely as it will cook in the chicken stock. Now I'll flip the sides to get the beautiful color of the skin. And that's it. This is done. I'll keep this aside. So next let's prepare the flavorful rice. So for that here I have taken rice. I have soaked it for half an hour and then drained it and kept it for 20 minutes. It's very important to keep this aside for 20 minutes after draining it. If you go to China, Singapore, Thailand, they have their own influence on this recipe. They make it in their own way. So this is my version of Hainanese chicken. What I have learned after eating them so here's the rice now into this goes the flavorful fresh chicken stock now to this i'll add a bit of oil and now some salt the rice would be very flavorful some pepper powder give this a mix some people add chopped garlic and ginger to this i'll not add i'll keep the rice plain and simple now this will go on the flame and let this boil when this comes to a boil then we lower the flame and cook till the rice is perfectly done now comes the part of cooking chicken so for that here again i'll require some stock this goes into the pan and to this lots some more salt some pepper powder some garlic some ginger the quantity of ginger should be bit more than garlic give this a mix and now i'll keep this for boiling i'll remove this chicken on a plate this has lots of element in it so here the rice is getting cooked here the stock is getting boiled for our chicken in authentic hainanese chicken they use the whole chicken but at home it is not convenient to use the whole chicken so here i am using the cut pieces so here the stock is boiling so now what i'll do is i'll put the chicken pieces into this and now again i'll cover this and cook for 5 minutes and then i'll switch off the flame and keep this in stock for 20 to 25 minutes this will help the chicken to cook properly and the flavors are intact so after keeping this for 20 to 25 minutes the chicken is perfectly cooked you can see meat has left its bone this is the perfect indication that the chicken is perfectly done you can see how juicy this is this is the reason i kept this in the stock i'll remove this and keep this aside now what i'll do is here i have taken a muslin cloth and a strainer 
I'll strain the stock in which I had boiled the chicken. It is very flavorful, so please don't throw it. You can serve this along with the rice. I'll remove it and keep this aside. So our chicken is ready, rice is ready. The only part remaining is the bean sprouts. So for that, I'll quickly heat up a pan and add oil into this. And now let's stir fry the bean sprouts. Perfect. This goes in. Some spring onion greens, light soy. Give this a toss. Perfect, this is done. Now let's heat up the stock. Now the only part remaining is serving. So for that, what I'll do is, I'll make some slits in the chicken just to show you that the chicken is perfectly done. And that's it. For serving, I have taken a slate. First, I'll put some cooked rice. This is perfectly cooked. Wonderful aroma. Just press it lightly so that there are no air pockets and you can demold it easily. I'll keep this on one side. And now here, I'll place the chicken. Some bean sprouts, some bean sprouts on the side. And some nice hot chicken stock, flavorful chicken stock. I'll demold it. And that's it. Here it is, our Hainanese chicken rice. I'll put some soya sauce on the rice, some on the chicken. Here it is, my version of Hainanese chicken rice, only for you. I know you like our videos, so hit the subscribe button. Stay connected, happy cooking.